Hey everybody, Tim here from the Tactical Defender at camp number one. I apologize, it's really windy. I hope it doesn't ruin my audio. But, uh, first I hope you're all well. I know it's been a while and you will be seeing me more often uh, coming very, very soon. Ibex 35 from VanQuest. Now, I've said it before and I'll say it again, right? I review a lot of backpacks to those of you that follow me on a regular basis. There's a lot of brands that I like. I have two brands that are my personal favorite. One is 511 Tactical. I really like their Rush Packs, the 12, the 24, and the 72. I know a lot of you like the Franken Pack, what I did with the 24 with all the pouches from BDS Tactical. Love that pack, but it's lacking something the Ibex 35 really excels at. Someone has been asking me, a few people have been asking me, I, I don't. I see you always use the Ibex 35 by VanQuest. We know you like the pack, Tim, but what about the pack that really does it for you, like really floats your boat? And you know what does it for me? I mean, aside of the YKK zippers, the amazing quality, the two uh, compression straps is really a must for me to carry things uh the cordora brand you know you, you got all the best products the pouches inside it's just phenomenal everything about it is phenomenal but for me the thing that really excels this pack out of a out of all the other packs i've used is this right here it's that the back of the pack the part that goes on your back the shoulder harness the padding, the lumbar support. I don't use it, but it comes with one of the best and most comfortable and adjustable waist belts that I've ever used in my life. I'm really not into them, but when I get a pack, I will use it for a while to test it, if you will, before the review, but then I remove them. If it's not a removable waist strap, I'm not going to be happy with the pack. I'm just not, right? I, I like options. I want to be removed. Let's look at the shoulder harness. Shoulder strap, shoulder harness. Really nice and cushioned. Very comfortable. I have a whistle there. My SE number four, I, uh, I used to a lot, and then I stopped. I started carrying it again right there. Now, you have adjustable load lifters for your straps. One, two, and three grab handles gotta have grab handles if it doesn't have at least one grab handle forget about it if it's got three we're good again look at that lumbar this is where the belt would go look at that lumbar nice padding then you have the padding going up let me move these out of the way i'm doing this with a handheld uh, cell phone i apologize really let me go this way. see how look at how thick those are how comfortable those are now, another thing that I love, I mean, these are really, really comfortable shoulder straps. This is all one piece, as you can see. It just doesn't have the shoulder strap that goes up and it gets sewn into the pack. Not saying that doesn't work. The majority of, uh, of people that make backpacks do that. Again, not saying it doesn't work, but the fact is, this is so much better. This type of system. Also, this can either be removed, not sure why you'd want to, or let me put it back, or you can adjust this up or down. You can see these here. Where is it? Here we go. You see these here? And they go all the way from up here down to here. So depending on your body type, you can actually raise this up and down to fit you. Now, me, my body type, the Rust 24 with the BDS Tactical um, pouches, I do. I love it. And if you told me that's all you're ever going to use, Tim, I'd be happy as a you-know-what. But I use this pack a lot for a bunch of reasons. The really, the biggest number one selling point for me is this area right here. The part that comes in, in uh, touch with your body, the carrying system is absolutely, honestly, it's just, I can't say enough about it. It just fits me, my body type really well. Um, I kind of have a taller upper body from the waist up. I like a longer but thinner 
pack not shorter but wider if you know what i'm saying which is exactly what the rust 24 is again great pack but this one really does it all for me i test not test but review a lot of backpacks i always go back to the vanquish the vanquish products for me are, are where it's at I, I just cannot be happier with them and this particular pack just does it for me i could put my uh see what i mean by the double uh compression straps i can put my tripod there on this side i just put i just have a drink i usually have a water bottle but i left it at home it wasn't clean i put one of vanquest water bottle holders on there i just i love the pack i can't say enough but that shoulder harness the adjustability the padding does it for me i've never had to move this I've got some dirt bikes in there, but I've never had to move this. When I got it, I said, oh, oh, wow, it goes up and down. I really like that. It's adjustable. I like options. Let me leave it where it is, and let's see how it feels, how, how I carry it, and I love it. It works. Uh, that's it, everybody. Um, so for a few of you that have asked me, why do I use that more than the Rush 24? That is it right there. The rest is great. The rest is wonderful. But it's this area right here that really does it for me. I hope that answers some people's questions. Please be well. Stay safe. And we will talk soon. Bye.